Welcome back to Infigyan, my dear friends. Today in this video, we are going to take up one very interesting challenging question from quintic equations. This equation is quintic, so we will have to find out five solutions. I will showcase two different methods to solve this problem. So let's get started by writing method number one. Here I will use one exponential property. It is a power b whole power c. It is equal to a power bc. So I will write our very first term x plus 5 whole power 6. This power I will split in this manner x plus 5 whole square and then whole cube. So 2 times 3 is 6 using this exponent law or property. Second term similarly I will write x plus 3 whole square then I will be writing q right hand side if you will see it is 4 cube and then x plus 4 whole cube done now i will use substitution and substitution would be this bracket whole square bracket i will call a this whole square bracket i will call b and right hand side i can write this right hand side as 4x plus 16 whole cube it is now i will call this is equal to this bracket equal to c 4 cube times x plus 4 whole cube so we can merge both the bases 4 times x plus 4 times 4 that is 16 now i will write both the a b values separately let me write here a is equal to x plus 5 whole square so i can write x square plus 2 a b so 10 x plus b square 5 square 25 similarly i will write my b value it is x plus 3 whole square if i will write then i will be writing x square plus 6x plus 9 now i will find what is the value of a minus b because a minus b will come out some some value see minus 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 so 10 minus 6 4x 25 minus 9, 16. Now you can see it is equal to your C value. So I can write this value is equal to C. So conclusion is what I can conclude from here. From this equation what we can write. A cube minus B cube. It is equal to A minus B whole cube or C cube. Both are same thing. So now I will solve this cubic equation. You can see a cube minus b cube. Let us expand it using formula a minus b whole cube. a cube minus b cube minus 3ab and in bracket a minus b. So let me write directly c or let me write here a minus b. Now you will cancel. Now what is left? minus 3ab a minus b a minus b is c so i can write it is minus 3abc equal to 0 let us write here 3abc with minus sign equal to 0 or we can conclude from here either a equal to 0 b equal to 0 and remember what was a b and c c equal to 0. So let me write all the three values. a was a was x plus 5 whole square equal to 0. b was x plus 3 whole square equal to 0. c was 4x plus 16 equal to 0. Five solutions are clearly visible. From first equation, we will be writing x is equal to minus 5 and minus 5. From second equation, we will be writing x is equal to minus 3 and minus 3. From third equation, we will be writing x is equal to minus 4. So I am going to write this solution in terms of multiplicity. So minus 3, minus 4 and minus 5 is our final answer where minus 3 and minus 5 is having multiplicity 
2. Now let us consider method number 2. Conventional one it is or traditional method. Here I will give a straight away substitution because you can see 3 is there, 4 is there, 5 is there. So averaging of all the 3, it will give us 4. So let me consider our let substitution is x plus 4 is equal to suppose a. So x plus 5 will be a plus 1. So I will write our original equation in terms of a. So let me write here x plus 5 I should be writing a plus 1 and similarly x plus 3 I will write a minus 1. Let us write our original equation x plus 5 whole power 6. So a plus 1 whole power 6 minus x plus 3 whole power 6 a minus 1 whole power 6 equal to 64 times 64 times a cube. Now I will use Pascal triangle. Let me draw it first. Let me write here Pascal's triangle. So I want expansions coefficient actually. So let me write here 1, 1, 1, 1, 2, 1 for power 2, 1, 3, 3, 1 for power 3, 1, 4, 6, 4, 1, power 4, 1, 5, 10, 10, 5, 1, power 5. Now this is our required power 6. 1, 6, 15, 20, 15, 6, 1. All the coefficients are now clearly known. Now I will use, I will use expansion method. Let me write here a plus 1 whole power 6. You can see coefficients are 1, 6, 15, 20, 15, 6, 1. Because of our expansion, second term is 1. So no need to worry. I will begin with a power 6. Then it is 6 coefficient. So 6 a power 5. Then coefficient is 15, 15 a power 4. Then I will write 20 a cube. Then I will be writing 15 a square. Then I need to write 6a plus 1. Done. Now if you will write a minus 1 whole power 6, where this sign is going to change, here you will be having minus, here you will be having minus, here you will be having minus. Once you are taking difference, because it is having difference sign. So let me write here a plus 1 whole power 6 minus a minus 1 whole power 6. Then what we will have? If the sign change, that will be added. So I will write 2 times 6a power 5 plus 20a cube plus 6a equal to 64a cube. Now you can see this is our equation ultimately. Now both sides are divisible by 2. So let me divide by 2. But better is to consider 2 common from the bracket first. So it will become 4 times 3a power 5 then 10a cube, then 3a. Now you will write right hand side 64a cube. Now divide both sides with 4. So I will be having 3a power 5 plus 10a cube plus 3a equal to 16a cube. Once I will take 16a cube to the left, then I will be having 3a power 5 minus 6a cube plus 3a equal to 0. So let me write here 3a power 5 minus 6a cube, 10a cube minus 16a cube. Then I will be having 3a term equal to 0. Let us consider 3a common. So I will take 3a common. What would be left? a power 4 minus 2a square plus 1 equal to 0. Now you can see bracket is again one perfect square. So I will be writing 3 times a and this is a square minus 1 whole square. Now you can remove this 3. f dot g equal to 0. a will be equal to 0. Remember what was a? a was our substitution. This was our a. x plus 4. 
सो एंड सेकेंड इक्वेशन ए स्क्वायर माइनस वन होल स्क्वायर इज इक्वल टू जीरो लेटस राइट द वैल्यू ऑफ ए नाउ लेट्स पुट द वैल्यू ऑफ ए ए वॉज एक्स प्लस फोर सो आई विल बी राइटिंग हेयर एक्स प्लस फोर इक्वल टू जीरो कंक्लूजन एक्स इज इक्वल टू नेगेटिव फोर दिस इज अवर वेरी फर्स्ट सोल्यूशन now second equation if you will write equal to 0 then we'll be having a square minus 1 equal to 0 consider a square root both sides now i will put our substitution a so it will become x plus 4 whole square minus 1 equal to 0 this value i have substituted now a square minus b square consider like this is a square minus b square a plus b so x plus 4 plus 1 a minus b x plus 4 minus 1 equal to 0 so x plus 5 times x plus 3 equal to 0 conclusion is minus 5 and minus 3 and remember both are having multiplicity 2 because of whole square so let me write multiplicity 2 let me write here our final solution x is equal to minus 3 and minus 5 both are having multiplicity 2 and minus 4 separately so overall we are having five solutions let us verify now our results our solutions so i will be writing verification let me consider the very first value x is equal to minus 3 so here in the original equation i will be putting minus 3 okay see what will come out x plus 5 so 5 minus 3 2 raised to the power 6 minus minus 3 plus 3 0 equal to 64 4 minus 3 so 1 power 3 now you can see 2 power 6 is 64 equal to 64 verified so this solution is true second solution minus 4 Okay, let us put minus four plus five, so one power six minus minus four plus three minus one raised to the power six. So again, it will come out one power six equal to left hand side is zero equal to right hand side sixty four four minus four zero. So zero is equal to zero. This is also true verified. Now let us consider x is equal to minus five only. let me write here x is equal to minus 5 so this term will be minus 5 plus 5 whole power 6 that means 0 minus i will write minus 2 whole power 6 equal to 64 minus 1 whole cube minus 5 plus 4 it is minus 1 whole cube now you can see 0 minus this would be 2 power 6 64 equal to 64 times minus 1 So minus sixty four is equal to minus sixty four. This is also true and verified. So x is equal to minus five is also tested or verified solution. Ultimate solution becomes minus three minus four minus five. I hope this video will be somewhere meaningful to you. Do not forget to like, share, subscribe, friends. Bye bye till next video. Good luck and take care of yourself.